Look at him. Look at him. Got his car shattered, man. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the house, man. He was like, why? This bitch broke up with me for no reason. <laughs> Bro. Yeah, that's going to be the next me right there, I think. <laughs> <coughs> Alright, so this next reaction rocks is going crazy. Compilation part too by my good favorite of mine Patrick now apparently we got another of the compilations that Ross is going very crazy about it cuz when we saw it on live you know when we saw the part of some like the WWE uh, pay-per-view and stuff Ross can go crazy along with me cause I definitely go crazy as well man you know but um yeah, that's that's how that's how it is, man. But um yeah, so um <laughs> but uh let's let's just check it out in five, four, three, two. Tell them guys I said it would be I said see you at the top And they misunderstood me I hold no resentment in my heart It's that maturity And we don't keep it on the set anymore It's with security I'm outside 29 I got true, I like it Yes! Yes! Fuck you! Eat a dick, you pussy! Hello, Ross. <laughs> Ross. Look, 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 Ross. No, bro. Still no, Ross. Chair. No! Uh... Don't you do it! Be quick! No! 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 Holy! Oh! Oh! Holy fucking shit! Yeah, that's fucked up, man. The shock of the fear, man. Aw, <laughs> oh, shout out to Blondie, man. Blondie's like, are you okay? What happened? That Blondie is very nice. Blondie is very lovely. I ain't gonna lie. Oh my. I ain't gonna lie, man, cuz. I saw this last time, I think, uh, last year, I believe. Yeah, I think it's last year. And I ain't gonna lie, man. WWE is totally going soft for not allowing for any male wrestler to hit, you know, to like perform the first. Well, actually, they did do that. You know, only for like a finishing moves or a signature moves or whatever. But the only thing is, the problem was that they were too afraid to either you, either you want to hit Rhea Ripley so bad because, like, I think she is starting to come complete mad annoying heel. And I ain't gonna lie, go with Dominic as well because. That's only the problem that they're too afraid. Like, like if you try to like slam your like you try to perform a finisher move or signature moves towards women wrestlers in WWE, if that would happen like somewhere like Raw or SmackDown or any you know in a um, live event or pay uh, pay per views and stuff because. That's only the problem, cause like most of the fans will get so mad at you for no reason why, because dude, you have every right to do that finishing move on a woman wrestler, because face it, man, you have to do it sometimes. Otherwise, they don't think you're soft, cause that's only the problem about it, and. <laughs> Call me savage, but I would have did the same thing if I was a WWE wrestler. I, like, I don't even care because I want to like, like just hit the RKL at Red Ripley because, hell, like, 
you know, you know, mommy, why you feel mommy? Like, dude, Dominic, that is not your mommy. All right, that's your stuff, mommy. All right, cause <laughs> that is your stuff, mommy. Okay, and she been trying to manipulate you the entire time, and you gonna let that happen? Like, you wanna choose a child over this stupid ass bitch that what? Like, like she's sort of special or something? That's why. That's why you're a fucking worst son I ever see in my goddamn life. No wonder. <clears throat> like, I'm glad that Raven Steer whooped your ass. Cause you're never gonna learn how to respect your own family. Cause if I was him, I would have brutalized you forever. Because and never wrestle again. Cause. Like, you're becoming one of the most annoying wrestlers of all time. Like, I thought you were cool ever since then. Like, you know, you got to, like, like, he, like, step, like, you remember when Step Rollins, like, hit you with a Kendall stick, like, 20 times. And I respect you. Remember when Roman Reigns power, you know, throwed you off the ring? Well, Powerbomb throw you off the ring in a SmackDown? Yeah, I respect that. Because I see you take a lot of bumps to it. But then now you want to be joining us Judgment Day because of what? Because your stepmommy, Rhea Ripley? <laughs> yeah, you gotta be a fucking joke, man. Like. No wonder, no wonder Rey Mysterio would left your ass in the first place, cause, yeah, yeah, I take that shit personal, cause why? Cause, I thought you was cool, Dominic. Like, I thought you were really cool, but now you're not cool, cause, I would have fucking spinning right in your goddamn face with your disrespectful looking ass, cause, yeah, cause all you did was. Make their life and live in hell you like like your father, your daughter, your mom, your your father, your daughter, your mother, like come on now. Like are you like kidding me? Dominic Like what the like what the fuck is wrong with you man? Like Oh I can't wait to get my hands on you because I really hope if I were the wrestler I can't wait to get my hands on you. Permanently, cause I'm tired. You, I'm tired. You're spoiled, bread-looking ass. Mommy, I need help. Yeah, like grow the fuck up, man. Grow up, cause you would take that shit very personal. I would have beat your ass very personal. Motherfucker. Yeah, I have the right to be angry, cuz. Oh my god. This is definitely violating ocean rules. Oh, what yeah. What is this? Yo! I remember yo, that. Yo! What the fuck? <laughs> Holy shit! Bro, he's yeah. rolling out of the ring. Holy fucking. Uh, Rest in peace to the ring. Rest in peace to the ring. Throw up your ex for the ring. Holy shit. Yeah, I remember shit. that. Brock oh, let go the no, no. ring with the trapper with the tractor. I like what the hell? I need to go back and watch that again. Uh, even though SummerSlam is coming up um over at August, which I'm very excited because I'm actually I'm actually gonna be able to go over there because I'm very excited about it when like SummerSlam um over at Detroit. Yeah, I'm I'm very lucky. I'm very excited about it and. And the thing is, I did not know that that Brock Lesnar literally going to destroy the ring with that trap there. I'm like, wow, that shit was crazy. Like, that's definitely crazy, bro. Oh, you gotta go, bro. <laughs> no, Roman. Yes! yes! Go with that! Yes! Go, go with that! Yes! Go yes! Run. Don't 
over. This ain't over. Yes! I don't give a fuck about the world. Yes! 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 But I really love Ross so much. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> I think I remember this. The class of the class of the castle. I didn't like see that one for a while, but yeah, it is so crazy because I thought that Drew McIntyre was really about to win the the Universal Championship. And then Solo came out of nowhere. Like, that's bullshit. That could be it. But instead, that's only the problem. Like, some heel wrestlers are cowardly. Because they're too afraid to lose. And even though that's how it starts, then, and that's only the problem. I, I don't know, man. It's just, yeah. I think, I think some of the heel wrestlers are starting to come pretty annoying, if you ask me. Cause I don't know, man. But some heel wrestlers, they are very unstoppable. To like, you know, even though without team, which I'm okay with it, cause you know, you know, they would try to do that. No, I'm like, um, let's just say, like, um, ah, nah, it's gotta be some heel wrestler that, it's gotta be some heel wrestler that did that without cheating. Uh, y'all comment down below, cause I'm trying to figure it out, but yeah. But you, you understand what I'm talking about, you know, heel wrestlers without cheating, you know, become very unstoppable and, Beast and all of that. Well, of course, Brock Lesnar, of course, but you, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> my cousin! Oh! Shit! Oh! 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 Yo! Oh! 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 Steve Austin so much, man, because when that glass break, 
you know, everybody, the crowd was going wow, like, like, everybody was going crazy, because everybody loves Stone Cold Steve Austin so much, I didn't go, <laughs> that was crazy, let's, let's see it again, man, music to my ears, bro. Oh! <laughs> oh! Oh, dude! Yeah! Oh! Oh, dude! Damn it! Oh, dude! Oh, dude! Oh, fucking do it, bro! Yeah! Go! 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 It was only right, man. Oh, <coughs> bro. Yo. I told you. Hey, super they time now, bro. They have to do it again. Yeah. They, they have to do it again. Get it. Bold ass prediction, bro. Stone Cold couldn't just be here for one night, bro. Woo. Woo. Just like old times, baby. Get it. Yo, I'm about to I lose agree. it, bro. Like, well, oh my man. God. Wait a minute, Yo, bro. Don't be seeing us today. He, he, oh, he's going to win this. Oh, my God. They did it again. Oh, Yo. There it is. Yes! Oh my god! Hit him! Yeah! There we go! Yo, let's go! Yes! <laughs> yes! For two nights, yes. man! Hit him in! Oh! God, god damn! Yo! Did you see it? It might be the best song I've ever seen, dog. Yeah. No, I ain't gonna lie. There we go! There we go! Get yeah. it, man, dog! Yeah. Yes! Come on! Oh my god, bro! Come on! <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I ain't gonna lie, man. What I what I remember watching the Money in the Bank oh two years ago, you know, in like 2021, I did not know that John Shell was going to return. Like I freaked out. Like holy shit, man. Like, I've been knowing John Cena over a year, like, he's part of my childhood, man, along with, um, Stone Cold Steve Austin, The Rock, The Undertaker, Mick Foley, I mean, hell, like, and during the ruthless aggression, like, I always focus on the main ones, like, John Cena, Edge, yeah, John Cena, Edge, Batista, well, except JBL, of course, you know. Because then, you know, he's he's annoying heel, of course, as well. But yeah, but well, let's just say I'm only focused on Jossie and S and Batiste as well. Oh, and Randy Orton, and probably um Triple H too. Like I always focus on the main ones for some reason. Why? Because I thought. Like hell, like it it brought me back so much time, cause even though I focus on more of John Cena, and I have to say it, cause um John Cena is one of my favorite of all times, and I gotta say, which is sucks, cause I heard that John Cena is actually gonna retire for now, cause um. Man, like, I'm actually gonna miss the old days for John Cena, and, but hopefully, maybe, we'll see. I mean, we'll, I think I'll see him around on the movies, of course, cause, you know, hey, you always love with some WWE wrestlers, or probably other 80, well, Probably some other wrestler that want to volunteer for some acting, of course, because, hell, you probably know, man. But yeah, man, that that part, I lost my shit, because I did not know that, like I said, I did not know that John Cena was going to return. I was like, wow, like, he really is returning. I was like, wow, like, I, thought, I thought it was a thing, like, holy shit, bro. Come on!
Is this the Krusty Krab? They actually do. That's how true. I love it. That that is crazy, man. Like holy shit. Like I lost my mind, you know, in this man, like that was that was amazing so far, bro. Like, oh my god, that that was definitely crazy. I'm loving this. Like, <laughs> I don't blame Ross, man. If you want to go crazy, let's go crazy from watching the new WWE, and of course, I mean, yeah, because you know. It's what it's what it's all about, man. Cause next time, I actually gonna go to WWE SummerSlam over in, uh, over in Detroit. Cause um, I'm very excited about it so far, man. I I can't wait to go there. Like, I'm so very excited, man. Like, I gotta like fix myself up before I get ready. Cause um. I mean, hell, man, who knows, man, it's gonna be a lot of fun, like, a lot of fun to, to for me to watch it, and, well, for me to see it, cause, um, like, I am excited to see, um, Cody Rose, Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn, um, probably also, of course, well, yeah, but, um, of course, Roman Reigns, uh, Brock Lesnar, but, Bianca Belair, um, and Bianca Belair, uh, uh, Asuka, um, I mean, I'm, I'm excited about, like, like, it's gonna be my first time, you know, watch, you know, going there for the, like, cause I'm gonna be so nervous about it, cause, even though it does help me a lot sometimes, but also it could help me, you know, do some more of me doing, you know, join in some academy stuff for me to get started on my own career. Well, soon, cause we'll we'll see. Cause I'm I'm actually excited about it. Cause that like I know I'm gonna get so much goosebumps you know, going there, and, yeah, I'm gonna get so nervous, like, it's gonna be my first time ever going to the summer sale over at Detroit, which is crazy, like, holy shit, man, like, I really want, I really want to go there so bad, because it's gonna be my first, it's gonna be my experience for the first time, like, I hope so. If y'all see me through the camera, you're like, oh shit, this Tyler, holy shit. Yo. Yeah, that's, that's how I get very excited about it, man. But, yo. <laughs> but yeah, man, uh, let me know, comment down below what y'all think about Ross Gordon. Crazy compilations. Hopefully there'll be more of them next time just in case. So yeah, but um but yeah, so um I'll see y'all in the next draft video.